<clears throat> Yo, what's up guys? Good morning. Uh fresh out the shower. So yeah, I guess yeah, I see the video got cut off. And um I was about to get like deep into it, but on my way to work. But um I know how that go. You got a job to go to. And they ain't trying to hear what video you trying to do, and they need you to be there at the time you're supposed to be there. So, um, I was rushing that video. I'm shocked it turned out the way it did. But I guess I'll go ahead and finish. Um, this is part two since I got cut off. But yeah, um, it's me and Mickey Mouse. And you keep my me. That's my man. My homie. My dog. Old dog. I ain't no punk. Cause I have a Mickey Mouse. I like my Mickey Mouse. Um. But uh. Let me go ahead and finish this up real quick. Cause I ready to go to bed. And. I know y'all probably. Ready. Go ahead and stop looking at me. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Let's see. What was I talking about? Oh, yeah. She called, right? She called and then she texted me, and um, she was bringing up old issues. You know, like you, you don't, you change. Um, when I was dating you, you was doing this little stuff and this little stuff and we was acting like this and that. Now we ain't together. You act like this and this and this. And I, I just don't get it. Like, exes are, are they just meant to come back into your life to drive you crazy? Or you, you don't get it. What what accomplishments are you trying to make, you know, for real? When you become an ex and then you see that person you used to date and then they kind of doing their thing again or they not doing the stuff they used to do and they were with you. Now you want to trip on them. I don't, I don't understand that. I mean, for real. But yeah, she snapped on me hard. She was like, telling me what I did. And I was a girl hoppy. And I was about girls and stuff like that. I really wasn't. I was a flirt. Yes, still am. I'm a flirt. She knew that. I'm trying to get comfortable. And this ain't doing it. So, it's a little bit better. Um, a little bit better. But, um, yeah, so she hit me up on myself and all that. Blasey, blasey, hip hop, whatever. But, have y'all ever been through that? I mean, tell me what you think about the situation. I mean, I don't understand why exes think they have a second chance if it didn't work out the first time. Where it didn't work out the second time. It make you think it's gonna work. I wanna go through the stress again for a third time. It don't make no sense. Ain't nobody finna go through all that. I don't have time to waste in order to go back through something I've already been through, you know. If you've done it twice, why go through it a third time? Just let it go. But, I don't know. She was bringing up all this stuff. I mean, just <laughs> why? You know, I change. I mean, I guess people hate to see you doing good now, or you matured a lot. And since you've done that, they want to try to see if they can fit in somewhere into the new. 
Nope. Once it was acutized and once we departed or once the last bell didn't ring or the fat lady didn't sing on us or you know, the chains were cut, the ball dropped, <laughs> you know, whatever you want to wait, you want to say it once, it was over, it was over. I'm not Lenny Kravitz on my it ain't over till it's over. It's over. <laughs> it's over now. It's been over. But I don't know. April, I don't like exes like that, you know. Especially if you broke up on bad terms. They want to just, ugh, they're just evil. But, uh, yeah, sorry I got cut off, but this is part two of it, alright? Peace.